The third P for people making friends with Asperger syndrome is positivity. I'm not talking about some cliched, happy-go-lucky type of positivity. I'm talking about real deep, substantial stuff. Now, when you are of this perspective, you can see how something that's considered a disability that can be very frustrating and challenging can be really good. You can, in fact, become an expert. Ironically, if you suck, really, 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 really suck at something, and then you realize you suck, you can become better. You can get to the average level. In fact, you can surpass it. In, when, you get, when you go from the bottom to the average, you start to think, why would I want to stop there? Just keep going. I want the goal. This is ambition if you want to take it there. Like when in self-help groups say it's good to hit rock bottom because then you can see the problem for what it is, whereas if it's just sort of bad, you're not going to want to change it as much because you're getting a little something. If you have nothing, you can go all the way to the top because you have this drive to get there. Now, it's like the book in the Bible, Job. Job lost everything, but in the end, he got it all back. And this is what happens when you have a disability in life. There's the potential to get it all back twice. That's what happened to Job. Twice. He got it back twice. I'm not saying just because you have Asperger's syndrome, you're automatically going to get it back twice. Not necessarily. You have to take initiative. You have to take the bull by the horns. And if you endure that with righteousness and with ambition, you get double what you got when you started. You can be better than everyone else if you have the urge to read motivational books, social books, speaking books, books on human relations, spiritual books. Read all that. Read nonstop and you can get to the top and you can become an expert and your perspective can be the best thing out there. That's the beauty of it. That's why it's important to be positive. Don't say, hey, this is so hopeless, I can't do anything about it. Not only can you get to a better level, you can possibly get to the best level and you can have the drive, the initiative, the ambition, the desire that other people will not have. And that's something you can be thankful for in the end.